<laughs> What's up, family? CJ Haru coming to you again with some more art techniques on uh, fabric. Today I'm working on the hawk, the falcon, Haru. And of course, I always start with the eyes. Leads to the soul again. Start with the eye. The out. Once I get the eye, it's like when I'm doing portraits. Once I get the eye right, then I measure out everything else from the eye. So right now, just pretty much the eye is a circle. It ain't like the human eye. Then I'll, uh, from that, just get the outer line of the eye. This part right here. On like this. And what I'll do with this one is pretty much this is white, black, and a brownish color. So what I'll do is I'll just go to the brown right here behind the eye. A little bit of brown leading down like this. It's gonna add more, probably more vibrant than this picture. It was kind of faded, but a little brown right here behind the head, behind the eye, like this. And the rest of it's pretty much black and white, so it's a lot of white in this picture. So, what I'll do is I'll go back to the eye and just a little bit while it's still drying. When painting t-shirts is like each fabric is different but what you do is you go back and forth because it adds different dimensions to it you can't just paint at once there's all the colors are blending together so go like this underneath the eye like this this part of it and I'll measure the eye this part of the eye goes down so his mouth, so his mouth is about right here, goes up like this, and I just do under the beak like this. What I do is I always use all the colors, like white. I'm just using all the white right now. Then I go back to it, add a little more paint to add the feathers come more alive. And because this is a sky background, I airbrushed it earlier, but I'll get back to that on another episode as far as airbrushing. So what I'll do is feathers are like motion back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Add different layers to it. It's kind of more of like a more of a spiritual type picture. It's like the spirit of a hawk. That's why I put the background in clouds. And the reason I choose a hawk is because, I mean, the falcon is because the falcon is the fastest flying bird. They always, you always see it in Egypt because it represents going to the heights of yourself. So, one more. Right, look black. Shadows underneath his beak. More, you see, it's popping out. Different layers. I'll do is I'll always go back to the eye where I began. Put a little bit black right here. I always go back to the eye where I started. Go back to the eye. And I add a little yellow. 
like we're looking directly into the sun underneath and I add a little yellow wherever wherever the person or thing is facing you always put the, the yellow or white on that side so that's about it quick painting family again there you go voila CJ Haru Thank you. Yeah.